Llewellyn, Llewellyn, I got something to tell you. Oh, Mary Grace, now you just... Okay, okay, I'm listening. Listening again to your crazy conspiracy. Listen, okay, now here, I was just on the Twitter, and on the Twitter, well, you know who is, you know who is Elon Musk? Of course I know who Elon Musk is. Everybody knows who Elon Musk is. Yeah, well, Elon Musk, he's the multi-billionaire who owns the Tesla auto, auto electric cars. And he's the one that's got the SpaceX rocket's gone into outer space, going to take us all to Mars by 20, 2040. Anyway, uh, do you know who AOC is? Why, everybody knows AOC. Can't watch mainstream news and not know the Green New Deal and AOC. Yes, I know who is AOC, the congresswoman from New York. Well, AOC, there's multiple Twitter accounts of AOC out there. And AOC has just made a demand saying, Mr. Elon Musk, if you want a chance with me, you're going to delete the parody accounts of me. This is not funny. This, I'm not going to take this any longer. I'm going to get the Congress to pass a new law banning parody accounts. So, oh, you're going to tell me now, Mary Grace, the ALC is going to ban parody accounts? Well, if, what, huh, can you imagine the kind of bureaucracy out there trying to regulate who's behind who, which account is really belonging to who? Why, it's almost like they're going to bring out, roll out the Canadian National ID, without which you can't even get online unless you submit yourself to government bureaucracy to prove your online speech. Saying a free speech. Lou Ellen, I just don't know if I can take this anymore. Oh, now, hold on. Oh, Mary Grace, let's go have a, let's go have a cold shower there. We gotta just mellow you down. Chill out.